Well, he is one of the hottest new chefs in America. Mm -hmm. That's according to Food and Wine magazine. Damar Brown is the sh uh, chef de cuisine at Virtue Restaurant and Bar. All right, and he's joining us now to talk to us a little bit more about uh, this new honor that you got. It's congratulations. So yeah, congratulations, so much. first of all. I hope you had a big party and that you celebrated correctly. <laughs> We did. Um, you, did. you know, we, we had a, a party race. in New York, right? <laughs> um, not yet, but it's coming. Okay. Um, had a great time. Went to New York for the party with all the rest of the chefs that were honored. Um, it was a lot of fun. Okay, and let's yeah. explain to folks what this is. So you are one of the top chefs, according to Food and Wine magazine now, which is an amazing honor. So describe mm -hmm. how you got selected and why maybe they chose you as opposed to someone yeah, else. There were only 11 yeah. chefs for 2022, <laughs> and you were one of them. Yeah, you know, honestly, um, the restaurant editor Kushbu uh, Shaw goes to all these restaurants in the country and tries to food and kind of looks into the story and who the person is and she found my story and my food to be you know to be good so yeah. <laughs> it, it, it was a really big honor and to think that you know I get to cook food that I'm really passionate about mm -hmm. that represents my background and people are resonating with it and they decided to celebrate it is really amazing to well, you. Know, so. Chef, it's, it's not just the food, right? I mean, there's also a, an element of, of your heart and soul, your personality, because not only uh, in, the, in the magazine did you get this kind of spotlight, but you were on Bravo's uh, Top Shelf. You were a finalist and the fan favorite. Um, what is it that makes a chef sort of stand out in, in a very crowded field in your, in your mind? Uh, I think just being consistent and doing the work. Uh, for me, I, I'm just being myself, right, which I guess resonated with people on Top Chef. Um, but I think just showing up and doing the work is what I've been doing and it's worked out pretty well for me. And one of the things as I was reading through your bio, you really try to push the idea of diversity and inclusivity in your kitchen and just to try to get um, anybody, any customers or patrons who are coming in to try different foods, to be adventurous, right? Yes, yes. Uh, I think that, you know, growing up, I didn't see a lot of me in kitchens. Um, I was fortunate enough to work with Eric Williams, uh, my chef and mentor, um, at a really young age. So I think it's hard to see yourself doing something when you don't see anybody that looks like you doing it. So we try to create more examples of uh, people of color in good this way industry. To do it. Yeah. yeah. How did it start for you? I know that your mother was, uh, she was a good cook, right? And that sort of, she, she nurtured that in you. Mm -hmm. She saw something in you and, and you sort of took it upon yourself and, and made it your, your life's work. Yeah, my mother and all the women in my family are great cooks. Um, so they figured out that I was interested in it. They leaned into it and really encouraged me, and it's, it's really paid off, so it started with them. All right, so as, as I'm here with one of the top chefs in the country now, one of 11, I got to ask you, what's sort of your favorite thing that you like to make? Or eat. Or eat, <laughs> whatever. Uh, you know, I like things that take a long time to cook, right? Okay. Braises, stews, soups, anything that kind of smells up the house. <laughs> uh, my grandmother's pot roast, for one, is one of my favorites. All right. But I just like things that really, you know, take time to get there. All right. Sounds good. Thank you so much for coming in. We wish you the best of luck. Yeah. And I would imagine from here you're going to have even bigger and greater success than you already have. Well, so. thank you so much. All I appreciate right. it. Great that. to have you here with us. And you can find Chef Damar Brown at Virtue Restaurant. Uh, that's at 1462 East 53rd Street. You can make reservations at virtuerestaurant.com. There's the info on your screen. Thought we, maybe we can get some lessons next time you come by. Make, yeah. make me a better chef. Will do. All right. Thank you so much.